Welcome, Total Drama fans. Put on some clean undies, because things are about to get wild. Yeah! 14 spanking fresh contestants and a totally brand new location, a Cree Island in Western Canada. As you might recall, during our Heroes vs. Villains finale, someone, and I prefer to remain nameless, accidentally destroyed our old island. So, this is where we landed. No shacks, no showers, no hotels, no hot tub. The only things we managed to save were the outhouse confessional and the horrific butt smells that live inside it. It'll be the roughingest roughing it that's ever been rough on Total Drama. So, buckle up. This is Total Drama Akatel Island. Simple confectionery will not save you from the pure evil of me. But yes, thank you. Well, nom, 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 nom. <laughs> Cinnamon! There is no need for you to be that spicy. <laughs> that guy's a little weird. Experiamus! I know many spells to ward off evil. Oh. Good? And there's nothing that can't be made sweeter with a song. Ah. So, ah, uh, switch seats with me right now. <sighs> Giants, are you and I gonna have a problem? Switch back now. Chris? No, Chris. What the? I don't get it. Chris. Chris has got to be here somewhere. Anyone seen Chris? You seen Chris? Stop your fidgeting. You scuff my patch and shoes and I'll toss you out the window. You'll be squished flat in two minutes. Actually, in the first 14 seconds, he would fall 1,800 feet, but then he would reach terminal velocity and drop 176 feet per second. So if we're flying at the recommended 32,000 feet, he would hit the ground in three minutes and six seconds. Wow, that girl has some real brains, huh? Brains? Whose brains? No one is getting my brains! some fun? <laughs> yes! yes! Huh, a couple of keeners. I'm sure a little pain and starvation will fix that. Let's get started. This aircraft stinks and is equipped with two emergency exits, here and at the end of the cabin. At said exits, you will find parachute packs. Only half of them contain actual parachutes. The other half contain surprises that will be utterly useless while falling from the sky. Well, hopefully we won't need them. Who knows? The season is full of surprises. Like this! <laughs> this is great. You've outdone yourself, Chris. <laughs> Parachute? Oh, no thank you. I'm actually a hologram. What? Why is I a hologram? <gasps> Abandon you! <laughs> the koala says cluck to the platypus for luck. Yeah! 
Yep. Feathers. I get it. Funny. Ah, I knew Chris wouldn't let me fall! Time to cast the spell. Hmm. Wings? Uh, page 318. Oh, that's just wrong. All right! I love hot dogs. Right now, not so much. Ugh, hey, thanks. Hey, my spell worked. <laughs> and here they come now. <laughs> OMG, I did it. Break my fall. Ow. Oh, sorry. Thank you, my feathered friend. You could have at least given me one of the parachutes. Shoulda, coulda, oops, didn't. But you're right, and I forgive you. Let's see. One, two, four, six, seven, eight, twelve. Eight. Huh, only one missing. Not so bad. If you do not release me, tree, you will be burnt to the ground. <laughs> Welcome to Pocketeo Island. On the right, everyone who had actual parachutes. Scarlet, Topher, Rodney, Jasmine, Max, Amy, and Sammy. Uh, it's Sammy? Amy says everyone calls you Sammy. Well, yes, but... Because you're the second twin. The lesser Amy, if you will. But my real name is... You're officially Sammy. This is so unfair. I auditioned for Total Drama to get away from Amy. Your team will be the Pima Peteo Gino Sewak, which is Cree for Soaring Eagle. Um, no, sorry, wrong. That means the floating salmon. Oh, <laughs> then I guess you're the floating salmon. Those without shoots, Sean, Leonard, Ella, Dave, Beardo, Sky, and Sugar. Your team is the Juanita Musquark, which in Cree means ferocious type. The confused bears? This is what you get for using a free online translator. My bad. Anywho, seeing as there's nowhere for any of you to sleep tonight, we figured your first challenge should be to build your own shelter. Oh, muffin tops. I'm too tired for that. <gasps> that was not me. A pageant queen never farts unless it is her talent. But there'd be more to it. Maybe she'd play a flute or... Hey, fart monster. Yeah, I was talking. Each team may take supplies from the common area before they begin to build. But these supplies are guarded by Chef armed with a powerful tennis ball blaster. A glancing blow will sting. Ow! <gasps> that only hurt a little. And a direct hit can take you right to the ground. <laughs> will someone please help that little boy to his feet? <laughs> oh. Good enough. On with the challenge. Team Musquak will build their shelter further inland. Team Gino Sewak towards the beach. Best shelter, according to me, wins the challenge. Begin! Bears, follow me! Let's move, Sewaks! Listen up, plan. we... We Three each should... grab... Can what do you think you're doing? For a second? On the farm, it's just me, my dad and my five little brothers. I'm kind of used to being in charge. It's always the big guys that are intimidated by me. Small guys too. <laughs> and most girls. I intimidate people. Just listen to the plan. We need to decide what items are important and make sure we get them. Got it? We'll do it her way. 
It's never wrong to let love be your guide. And that's how we'll win. Cool? With a plan that flowers, you, you and sunsets aren't not true. One pass each. Grab something good and make your way to... Yeah! She's totally right. Good call. I have some dirt on my hands, but no big deal. Let's do what she says. Right. The wood is the most important thing out there, so... If you have something to say, Scarlet, just bark it out. Um, no, but the wheelbarrow is more important than the wood because it's a class two lever, and with the wheel acting as a fulcrum, you can... We can carry... Carry stuff in it! My idea! Mine! Nice, Amy. You and Sammy help Rodney load the wood into the wheelbarrow and go. Heavy is my heart carrying a... Move it, Mumbles! Ow! Way to go, Sean! In my mind, I'm always running from zombies. And if you're not, you're crazy. Anyway, I grabbed some soup. Cream of broccoli? Aww! Hey, stop screaming. You're making us sound weak. I'm going for the rope. Everybody brings something good, okay? Hey I'll bring my face. Soup? He grabbed soup? You can't make a house out of soup. I once built a castle using nothing but a sunflower and the eyelash of a dragon. There's no way we can lose. We've got a wizard on our team. Hey, Chris! You'll be throwing a commercial soon, right? Um, why do you ask, Topher? Well, it's always been a little dream of mine to watch you work live! <laughs> Who am I to deny the dreams of such an intelligent young man? Pardon me a moment. Building supplies are being collected. Team Gino Sewak is doing a very wood job. But Team Musquak is looking kind of stupid. You don't want to miss any of this here on Total Drama Akatel Island! Bravo! Encore! Brilliant! I like this kid. We're back! The players are moving, Chef is shooting, pick your favorite team and start a rooting! <laughs> so funny! Love it! Thank you! But now it's time to get you back into the action. Okay. Uh, uh, ah! When a house is a home, then a home is a house. This is not a dress, it's a skirt and a blouse. Is she singing? I was a huge fan of Total Drama World Tour. And just because we don't have to sing anymore doesn't mean we can't sing. Not marvelous. Glitter? Is she out of her mind? She must be, because it's obvious that glitter should be mine. What? Dave, you draw Chef's fire while Beardo makes a run for the supplies. Ready? Um, Go! Hey! Hello? Here. Hey! Yo! Okay, Beardo, now! Huh? Why are you running in slow motion? <laughs> Come on! Ain't there another bucket of glitter somewhere in this mess? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Hold faster, minion, before we're... Ah! Ah! <sighs> this flow is beyond you. Fly, you fool. Um, okay. Go back to the shadows of Wawanaqua. Guy, I have an idea. You and me can... <coughs> oh. Wowzers! That girl's got some skills, huh? It's building time! Are you coming, or do you only want to get paid for half the episode? <laughs> an evil genius needs an evil lair to do his bidding. This cave will be perfect! 
try that again. <laughs> it's not important. To my lair! <laughs> it was very dark in there. I'd prefer something less spooky. Not to worry, no rush, plenty of time to evil. Topher, Scarlet, glue the boards. Rodney, help me with the support beams. Amy and Saini, faster! What are they building? Sounds pretty serious. All the more reason to work harder. Could you please stop making sound effects already? What are we gonna build? We have rope, straw, a hammer, some very pretty glitter. And soup, huh? We shall build a wizard's tower. Oh, yes, I second that. Wizard says sugar does. Who's with us? Tower. But no! No! We're not gonna- Dave, the team voted. Building something is better than building nothing. We gotta hurry. What do we do first, Leonard? First, we link arms and tent. Woo! Woo really? There, all done. This is nice. And a smart move, building it above ground level. Oh, yeah? And why is that? Whoa! Whoa! Here comes your answer! Ah! Oh, this island is a little more wild than our last one! <laughs> oh, zip it! Well, this is useless, but it's not done, Ella! Leave this to the professionals! Ah. Huh? Where's Sean going? Spend the night with a bunch of strangers who could turn into zombies while I'm sleeping? Ha! No thank you! Team Musquak! Wizard's Tower, huh? So, is it moose-proof? <laughs> is it what now? was a hard decision, but let's keep it real. Team Pimapateo Ginosewak wins the challenge! <laughs> no, evil does not high five. The winners of each challenge will be rewarded this season with a takeout order from a sponsoring restaurant. This week, it's the Petting Zoo Barbecue. The Petting Zoo Barbecue. Someone else touched your dinner. We guarantee it. Shoot! I always wanted a pony. Team Juanita Musquak, please go vote. One member of your team is heading home today. Oh, come on! Welcome to the Pocketeo Island Elimination Area. This is where we determine who stays to play another day and who gets a one-way ticket home. Can I vote for four people? A wizard's tower not win. The votes are in. If I hand you a marshmallow, you're safe. Sky. Yes. Sean, Dave, Ella, and Sugar. You are safe. Beardo, you did very little to help your team and tried to convince us that Sugar farted. <laughs> Leonard. You think you're a wizard, and you convinced your team to build something very, very stupid. Ella Forgeticus. Uh, yeah. Okay. The last marshmallow goes to... Leonard. Oh, marvelous. <laughs> Game over. This island is named Pocketail, which is the Cree word for exploded. So we thought it fitting that this season's mode of transportation home should be something with a bang. Without further ado, I give you the boom of a 
refreshment, the kablam of chagrin, this season's humiliating way home, the cannon of shame. <gasps> Any last words? So long, Beardo. Ugh, enough already. It was really nice to meet all of you. You know what's weird? I already don't miss him. <laughs> well, that's one down and 13 to go. Who's the next human cannonball? There are just too many good choices. Tune in and find out yourself here on Total Drama, Pocketel Island.